develop an online presence. Wow. And um, so far, so good. But uh, we want to scale it up a lot more if we can. Yeah. And in particular, in marketing and also in doing things a little bit different. Yeah, this uh, is for exactly the audience rather than just a traditional studio, you know. Yeah, maybe we can work together, uh, making some joint business together. Yeah, maybe. <laughs> the slides are coming in. Uh, They're yeah. coming in. Yeah. So, what what we are doing here? Yeah. Uh, the global project. The, the, the first problem in this industry, there is no any machine doing live presentation recording. No. Which is better than the live presentation? Okay. We claim the way we are doing really make a presentation better than the live presentation. So whatever they make a presentation, if you take this video in the conference, making video, and then we compare watching this video and watching in the class, yeah. we claim this is 100% better than yeah. watching there. It's a lot more engaging. Yeah, if this one is really true, this is a big news. Yes. So what we are doing here is once we make a beautiful screen, so, for example, now the uh, desk, the color looks like a slightly unmatched. Then we can make a color like this. And then every component, background, we can change any background like this. And then also you can change the color very easily. So whatever you want. And also the any, any universe you can make. And then we can bring this universe in a different way. And every part you can change by yourself. So all the tools here is for presenter. So you can bring any, any desk, for example, now this kind of desk we can make, and then we can slightly adjust, and then we can make it bigger, and of course we can change the color. Yeah. So all, all this part is made for presenter, not for broadcaster. Yeah. After you make a studio, the next step you have to do is bring multiple cameras to have a different angles. Yeah. Okay. Instead, we use one camera, uh -huh. and then using the one camera, we make a scene like this. So this is one action. And yeah. then for this section, they bring the monitors someplace. So we call this is a virtual whiteboard because all the whiteboard in the industry. Now, if you look at the, you know, the, the blackboard history, it was started from 1800. Yeah. Every classroom has a blackboard. And then after they have a project and multimedia, they have a whiteboard where they show multimedia content. And now everybody watches smart world. We have to bring the video with presenter, with virtual whiteboard. Yeah. So that's why we make a different scene like this way and many different way of showing for engaging students yeah, to see more interesting. Very good. So anything you have in the note you can show here. So ma making all the presentation in different way, you draw, change color, erase, so that way you make a bigger and smaller. Can you edit audio and... Uh, yeah, uh, all, all can... the audio going here and yeah. you can play music. Okay. Everything you can do integration. Yeah. And after that, you can show video, whatever we can show. Right. And this one is showing how we really make this one for, for distance learning. She sitting in the class. And we make uh, this up to the front screen. And this screen going to Skype to other Sweden yeah. Rudbeck University. Yes. Okay. And then they make a bi-directional conference with the audience feedback, perfect distance learning. And nobody complained watching this video from remotely because the same video showing in the local, same video for everywhere. Yeah. And you bring 10 class here by Skype or Hangout, so you really make an interactive video yeah. for every people. Yeah. Then makes a global. Now yeah. every school doesn't believe they can do yeah. distance presentation. Yeah. All the classroom, they believe every student has to come to class. Once we make a live from any classroom to any place, there's a huge market. Your yeah. global business can be expanded for life. This is what we're looking at in terms of uh, on the back of the programs we've done is some kind of one-to-one -one feedback and coaching sessions or one to a group yeah. also anywhere in the world, really. Yeah, because um, uh, so. the, there's a lot of content, uh, a lot of professors, a lot of yeah. the teachers in UK. Yes. A lot of teachers uh, wants to listen to this one everywhere. Yeah. There's a business market point. Yeah. There's no way how we transfer the, tra the presentation to that place. Yeah. This is the way how we can way expand. Yeah. That's very good. So that Just way, so. everything here. Especially when we did it in the early days, we had one camera that we had to keep moving yeah. and we do different presentations. We split the paragraph into two. Yeah, yeah, so yeah, I do yeah, yeah, six yeah, paragraphs yeah. that way and then, yeah, yeah, and then yeah, they, yeah. they mix it all up. Yeah, but uh, you know the older teachers and professors yeah. know what he wants to show. Yeah. If he give the tools how they manage everything by himself, yeah. you can save a lot of money Absolutely, from uh, yeah. producing no, the I product. Yeah? yeah, we spent quite a few pounds on um, 
Yeah, this is a huge well, amount the of the yeah years. yeah. So this one really save our production cost. All the high quality video become very cheap in this case. Yeah. So the only question is where is the pre nice presenter? He just make a notebook coming here. He can make all the value presentation. All the spending time for making camera action, editing, yeah. finish. Yeah. That's the whole idea we are trying to bring this industry. Good. You can upload your own videos and your